what is going on guys if you are new to the channel i want to welcome you to chasing florida if you guys are already subscribed welcome back to the channel today we're coming to you from miami florida i'm gonna be doing a little bit of snapper fishing it's a nice summer day the winds kind of laid down a bit boats are right here in the water we're out here in uh by the montes area we're gonna come out out to, out of biscayne bay and go out on the atlantic side and just set up a nice little chump slick and try and catch some snapper for the table we've already netted some pilcher i'll show you some of that action of us catching some bait but before i do that as always let's roll that intro Pull him up. Pull him up. Oh, oh. Yeah, he regurgitated your. Oh, one snapper. He's a little small. Some nice, nice, uh, nice colors on this fish. Look at that. Yeah, well, I don't know what it is. It's fighting hard. It's like a mangrove. It's a mutton. No, I don't think it's big enough. Damn. Why are these muttons? Oh, they have to be like 17 or something oh, like that. Shit. It's way undersized. Grab it. Swallowed it too. Maybe. These guys, bro, they don't know how to eat soft, dude. They just, let me get my plier and see if I can get it out. It might be too deep. So it may be too deep for him. Boom. Go, bud. Sorry. Yeah, he, he swallowed. I am on a monster barracuda. Babe, stop casting, bro. I don't know how he hasn't broken me up. Must have corner hooked his ass. Did you see him jump? Wow, what a beast. Damn, he smoked it, bro. Starting to gain a little bit of rhinos. Damn, he flew out of the water, bro, like a missile. What a beast. Hey, he went for a good run. This is on 20. 20 pound leader, bro. I don't know how he hasn't broken this off. Let's check this guy out. I may have to get the net for this one. I don't know if I can grab him. I can't even see him yet. Hold on. I'm trying to tire him out. Man, I must have corner hooked him because let me tell you, for him to. He's out there still. He's way out there. No wonder I haven't seen him. There he is. There he is. It's a nice barracuda. It's coming straight at me. It's coming straight at me. Look at him right there. See him? Yeah. Oh, he's not gonna fit in the net. That is a big cuda, guys. And he's hooked right in the corner of the mouth. It's working out my reel for sure. This is a small reel. Put it this way, if we get him on the boat, I don't know how we're gonna. I don't know, we're gonna have to cut them. Because shit. Oh, he's pissed. Trying to keep him away from the boat. 
Look at him right there. Look at the shark right there too. Woo! Big barracuda. Oh, I don't know. Get in the trolling motor. Let me get to the back of the boat. Watch out. Get over here. Look at this sea monster. Get over here, dude. Woo! Look at that toothy critter, guys. That is a big barracuda right there. Caught him on this little 50 size van stall. Look at that mouth. All right, buddy. Fixing to die. Oh, what? Watch out. Look at that two odd hook in his mouth, bro. Caught him on a two odd hook. Not crazy or what? He's like, stop recording me. This is embarrassing. There he goes. He popped off. Let him go. Good. Thank God. I really didn't want to bring him. Woo! Big guy. Nice. Well, that was pretty cool. A small one. Oh no, it's, a, it's like a mang. No, it's a small mutton. Small mutton snapper. The small mutton guys. Nothing too big. Really undersized. Need to grow. A lot of these smallies today, so mutton. Ooh. Did this thing anchor up, right? It did anchor up, right? Yeah. There. Really big one either. I just don't want this like a little bit bigger than the last one. Like this guy. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's a nice mutton. Trying to film me. Hey, hold no, on. I'm just gonna pull it in. Okay, good. Put the camera Okay, good shit. This uh, was a short one, guys. We pretty much caught and weeded through a lot of little mutton snapper and yellowtail. And we actually caught two nice yellowtail that were about 13 to 14 inches that we were able to take home. It was just two, one for me and one for her. And that was perfect. That's all that we needed. We didn't need to harvest anymore. And as you can see in the video, we were just running one chum bag and literally one chum block. We weren't out there for the whole day. If we would have been out there fishing for five to six hours, we would have brought in an entire case of chum, but we were just there to fish the morning and then head to the sandbar after actually we ended up staying at soldier key for the afternoon where my buddy had recommended us to go and i had never stopped in you know go and go and figure i'm born and raised here in the miami area never stopped there and uh gone by dozens of times and uh yeah just stopped in today and it was great i didn't keep that barracuda even though it was fighting pretty hard there are some people who eat them However, there's always a risk where you can get Cigaterra poisoning, Cigaterra fish poisoning, CFP, and that's something you don't want to get. So we didn't want to run the risk. We initially thought that we would take him for some family members, and then we ended up just breaking him off and letting him go on his way. Guys, that was a very fun fish to catch on that van stall VSX250. And I gotta say, it actually performed very well. That's this reel right here. I fished it, or I've already been fishing it for about, uh, I wanna say since Christmas. And uh, well, that's the first bigger fish I've landed on it. I've hooked a really, really big tarpon on that reel and spooled it, as you saw in one of my earlier videos. Uh, but yeah, that was, uh, that was pretty much it. We ended the day there at Soldier Key. And uh, I'll show you some pictures though of the fried snapper. I didn't record it. This isn't a catch, clean, and cook video, but we did fry the snapper and had them that very same day. Thank you so much for watching. Consider subscribing. Hit that bell notifications button so that you are notified when we are posting new content. Guys, comment below. 
if there's something else you guys want to see thank you guys again for watching and for those of you who have been with us from day one thank you very much we appreciate you guys as always see you in the next video